There is by my watch, but seven minutes to go. Gregory's getting away from the ball, having a word with uh, with the Buckley, and now he's gesticulating to his defence. The referee organising Rotherham, whose ten-yard line is forming up on the edge of the goal area. Rolled in goes Buckley, a first-time shot, and the whistle's gone again. As it's, a a it's a penalty. I do not believe it. The referee has given a penalty. I do not believe it for pushing in the line as Derby took the free kick. It went right through the line and O'Hanlon grabbed it on his knees on the line and the referee promptly gave a penalty. And several Rotherham players are refusing to get out of the penalty area. Oh, the way that penalties have been part of our season is unbelievable. Six minutes to go and this is one of the most vital penalties in our history. Not surprisingly, the success man at Vetchfield, Trevor Christie, is to take it. Six minutes to go. Derby County penalty. 1-1 the scoreline. Christie looking as cool as custard. Comes back. 1-2-3-4. Shoots. Goal! 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 Well, you'd not believe this run in. Who knows what the penalty was for, pushing as the free kick was taken. The referee had no doubts at all. Mr Fitzharris of Bolton pointed to the spot and Trevor Christie, veteran of no end of penalties at Meadow Lane, where in fact he only ever missed one penalty and that when Notts were leading four goals to nothing, has got the vital goal that puts Derby County into the lead and possibly into the second division but we're probably speaking too early five minutes to go my goodness this is going to be tense